Coinbase announced today that they're building their own Ethereum Layer 2 known as Base. In today's video, I'll share what we know so far and what this might mean for the future. Welcome back to Dynamo DeFi. As a reminder, all of my videos are to help educate you about cryptocurrency, not for financial advice. Now, let's get into it. Now, as a reminder for people who may not know, an Ethereum Layer 2 is basically a chain built on top of the Ethereum network that ultimately settles onto Ethereum. So in the case of Coinbase, you still use Ethereum to pay for fees and the network functions from the perspective of a user, just like you're using Ethereum. However, it's cheaper and faster because you're not using Ethereum itself, you're using another layer, which then ultimately gets settled down to Ethereum. And we cover layer twos a lot on this channel, and that's because I think it's one of the most important trends in crypto of the past year. If we go to this website, L2B, which tracks statistics of layer twos, we can see that over the past few months, layer twos have actually been processing more transactions per second than Ethereum. And currently they're processing just over twice as many transactions per second than Ethereum. I believe that if you look forward one year, two years, this is gonna be 10X, maybe even 100X, where layer twos are processing 100X times the transactions of Ethereum. And that sort of parabolic growth for layer twos fits in with exactly what Coinbase describes their vision for this new base chain as. So if we look at their website here, they wanna make Ethereum accessible to everyone. And if you look into the announcement in a little more detail, then they mention that it will be the home for Coinbase's on-chain products and an open ecosystem for anyone building Ethereum scaling solutions and dApps. And then importantly, they want it to be a seamless gateway for Coinbase users to access the broader crypto economy. And in my honest opinion, this chain is gonna be pretty big. If you look at Coinbase's users right now, they have 110 million verified users and $80 billion of assets on the platform. So that is a ton of users, a ton of money that could flow into this platform if they build it correctly. Even if you just look at the daily volume on Coinbase, they have $1.7 billion of trading volume, and that is in a market that is significantly down from what it was a year or two ago. And so once those 110 million people, once that $80 billion or some fraction of it moves onto this Ethereum layer two, then it's gonna be one of the most used chains of any that exists in the world of crypto right now. So I'm definitely gonna be watching this to see which projects launch. I think that there's gonna be a lot of opportunities to make some very, very nice investments if you can get in projects that become fundamental DeFi primitives on the chain early. For Base's part and Coinbase's part, they already have a list of many tier one projects that will be launching on the chain. They have Aave, one of the premier money markets. They have SushiSwap. They have Hop, which is a bridge specializing between Ethereum layer twos. And they've got a number of other projects as well. But what I really wanna see personally is the projects that are native to this base chain, because usually those are the projects whose performance correlates most closely with the growth of a chain. The next important detail about this announcement is that Coinbase is actually using technology built by Optimism to build this chain. So many people don't know that while Optimism is an Ethereum layer two, the foundation that built Optimism also built something known as the OP stack. And what the OP stack does is it allows anyone to spin up a new layer two solution and in this announcement, Coinbase describes the vision of this as eventually we'll have a super chain, which will basically be a mesh of different layer twos that jointly scale Ethereum and that are interoperable with each other. And Coinbase outlines four areas where they'll collaborate with the Optimism Collective. First is that they'll accelerate activity on the super chain. Right now there is one layer two built using this OP stack and that is the Optimism mainnet. The Coinbase base layer two will be the second one and then probably more will launch in the future. Second is that they're gonna actually add value to the super chain by providing a percentage of the fees earned through transactions to go back to the Optimism Collective to fund public goods infrastructure. Third is that they're gonna advance the developer ecosystem. So they're working closely with OP Labs to make it easier for developers to build new layer twos. And finally, they're building towards an interoperable crypto economy. So to start, base and optimism will be two separate layer twos, but they'll be building towards a point where those layer twos, as well as other layer twos in the optimism super chain are interoperable with each other. And in my totally honest opinion, 
this news and this partnership and this endorsement by Coinbase of Optimism's super chain mesh scaling vision is completely enormous for Optimism. If some of you might recall, although this turned out to be a curse in disguise, much of the thesis behind Solana in 2021 is that FTX was backing it so heavily. And another example, you have Binance Smart Chain and BNB was backed very heavily by Binance, and that grew to be one of the largest chains. So what happens when Coinbase, which is another major exchange, is throwing their weight behind this base layer and behind Optimism and Optimism's interoperability superchain vision? I think this moves OP into the top tier of crypto products. And while base isn't live yet, if you're excited about this launch and you want to do something to get ahead of it, then Coinbase is releasing a new base NFT and you can mint it for free. Already almost 35,000 have been minted for the next three and a half days. I'll post this link down in the description. As far as I know, this NFT isn't used for anything yet, but you never know what they might use it for in the future. Personally, I am planning on minting one. And that's what you need to know about Coinbase's new base layer two. Comment down below whether you plan on using this chain. And if you want more updates on Ethereum layer twos and base, be sure to like this video and subscribe. Until next time, this is Dynamo DeFi.